Beijing, a tanker carrying Iranian oil and run by the country's top oil shipping operator was ablaze and spewing its cargo into the East China Sea on Sunday after colliding with a Chinese bulk ship, the Chinese government said. The Sankey tanker, registered in Panama, collided with the CF Crystal about 160 nautical miles off the coast near Shanghai on Saturday, the Ministry of Transportation said in statement. The tanker's 32 crew members were missing. It was sailing from Iran to South Korea, carrying 136,000 tons of condensate, an ultralight crude. That is equivalent to just under 1 million barrels, worth about $60 million, based on global crude oil prices. Sankey is floating and burning as of now, the ministry said. There is an oil slick and we are pushing forward with rescue efforts. Dotted had sent four rescue ships and three cleaning boats to site by 9 a.m., it added. South Korea has also sent a ship and helicopter to help. A Korean Coast Guard official confirmed the tanker was still on fire at 1 p.m. He declined to be identified as he was not authorized to speak to the media. State media CCTV showed pictures of the tanker ablaze and billowing plumes of thick dark smoke. The government gave no details of the size of the spill. Reuters ship tracking data shows Sankey was built in 2008 and is managed by the National Iranian Tanker Company. Its registered owner is Bright Shipping Limited. It was due to arrive at Deason in South Korea from Kark Island in Iran on Sunday, according to Reuters ship tracking. The tanker, leased by Hanwha Total Petrochemical Company Limited, had valid foreign insurance, Iranian oil ministry spokesman Kasar Inori told Iran state television. Hanwha Total was not immediately available for comment. Sankey collided with CF Crystal, registered in Hong Kong, which was carrying 64,000 tons of grain from the United States to China's southern province of Guangdong, the government said. CF Crystal's 21 crew members, all Chinese nationals, have been rescued. It was due to arrive on Jan. 10. According to Reuters ship tracking data. CF Crystal, which was built in 2011, suffered non critical damage, China's transport ministry said. The collision is the second in recent years involving a NIT operated vessel. In August 2016, an Iranian supertanker hit a container ship in the Singapore Strait, with no loss of life or pollution.